Hello traders, Caroline Alizan here with Grok Trade. It is Tuesday, November 8th, 2011, and we are looking at the huge daily chart. Hope you all had a wonderful trading day and you've made some really good and profitable trades intraday. What a wonderful opportunity. But anyways, yeah, let's take a look at our chart and look what we see here today. And first of all, what I want to point at you is that we are above the 8 moving average, which you see here in green. And what it means is that we're not only above the 8 moving average, but also above the 200 day moving average, which we kept bouncing off of it here so many times. And the 200 day moving average is here in blue, as well as we are still above the 50 day moving average, which you see here in really dark red. So we are above all major moving averages right here, which means that we are continuing higher. And we are beautiful bouncing off of the 8 moving average here today, closing the day above it right at another area of resistance right here, the 58.90 mark. So pay close attention to that one as well. And the other thing that I see here, we are breaking outside of that base formation that we talked about here few days ago so we are closing today higher and we are slowly approaching another area area of resistance right here the 59 at about 5960 mark so this is an, another significant area of resistance for you to watch and then also pay close attention to all other areas of resistance on our way up so you should already have them drawn on our chart I just keep stressing that here to you because it's really important that you have all of them on your chart. And the other thing that I want you to pay close attention to is that 8 moving average which we bounce off of here today. So that is another significant area of support if we ever get a little bit of a pullback. We could at least to that area of support right here, the 58, the 5820 mark which we got stuck at here yesterday and we finally broke through it continuing higher making our next higher high and our next higher low so this is another indication that things are looking bullish at this particular moment but the other thing that I want you to pay close attention to is the MACD if you remember I told you yesterday that we were looking for a rise on the MACD if we ever get a little bit of a pop and that's what's happening here we're getting a pop on our chart things are looking bullish we're continuing higher with a rise on the MACD being above the zero line which means that we are bullish according to the MACD as well we are above the zero line which means that we're on a bullish territory and the other thing that I want you to pay attention to is the volume volume is not really impressive it's it's light volume it's still below the average but we still get that really nice confirmation here on the MACD as well as on our chart so volume is confirming it's not really impressive it's considered light volume but it's still close enough to the average so we could really take this as a yes so as a as a confirmation so that is what it is for you for today that's what I have here for you and hope it helps you have a wonderful trading day again tomorrow and I'll catch up with you soon